This is going to be a food bonanza. Yeah, it's a bonanza! Good morning, guys. Right, back for another week's vlogging. Um, just done Motor Home Mondays, that's just gone live. One of the big questions coming through from Motor Home Mondays is I said about um, when you do your daily checks, uh, make sure you've got the cover for the water heater back on, don't leave it off. And they're asking, a lot of you are asking, uh, what is that? And that is this. Oh, that's for the water heater, so it vents and it can breathe. If you leave this on and turn the water heater on, it'll turn on and then like 30 seconds later, it'll go to red. So it won't work. As I've just removed the cover to my water heater, that means shower time, which I'm gonna start the week as I mean to go on. Nice and fresh. And a fresh starts the week. Fresh vlog, fresh start, which means I need a shave and I need a haircut. I'm literally gonna transform from, I don't know, do I look my age, 30, 31, to about 12. Ready? And there you go, I look 12. All done. Money maker's looking good. I don't know if you can see, but right there on that bench, right, there's two ladies and they've been having a right old chat. <laughs> and obviously my shower window is right here. And I can hear them having a right old chat. So people have asked me, do I get a bit uh, conscious about having a shower like on in urban park ups, like on the street, in car parks, or anything, where people can hear me having a shower. I'm singing away, I don't care, I'm having a shower. I've got the window cracked open, so there's, you know, moisture's getting out. But no, uh, it's, they could probably hear me, because I could hear them clearly, having a right old chat. <laughs> one of their friends is not, not being nice to the other one. <laughs> Typical EastEnders lifestyle. No, oh, Jesus, anyway. No, I do not worry about uh, people being able to hear me. Um, I just crack on, get on with it, and just do what you're doing. You're in your home, do what you do. As long as you're not being a proper nuisance and the right pain in the arse, what's the problem? Right, so today I need to do some errands. I need to return a few parcels to Amazon, and I need to collect a few parcels, and I need to collect an eBay parcel from Sainsbury, from Argos. And so yeah, you get to see the full circle of uh, parcels and collections and deliveries on the road today. Huh? Ain't you lucky? Ain't you lucky? So these are my return parcels. Now, I don't know if you know, but you can just do a no print service. So all I do is usually, if I've got the original packaging, then I'll just chuck them back in that, seal them up, go over the labels, so they're not going to go back to me and then that's that done again that was another one same part uh, same packaging or packaging of another parcel gone over it you don't need to print anything and that one i didn't have another bit of packaging so i just put it in an envelope when you click the return uh, on amazon there is a no no print option which uh is usually royal mail and then you get a qr code you then go to Royal Mail, show me QR code, they'll take the parcel and then they'll stick their label on it and then that's it, it's done. They refund you the money uh, and uh, crack on. Because they, they, as soon as it's been scanned, they know the QR code's been scanned. So they know it's now in the system. And then if something did go wrong, so you sent them back an empty box, they're gonna, they'll find that out and then they'll go, <laughs> no, don't play them games. We ain't playing them games. It's just weird, you know. I am doing this on my phone right now and because I can, I know I'm on the camera, I can see myself above here, like, because it's a flippy screen. But because I'm doing this on the phone, I'm trying to just look at this stupid little, 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 little camera. And then not look at my beautiful face right here. Because <laughs> if I look here, then I'm not looking at you, and then I'm a bit, it's like, it's like I'm being rude. But if I look here, then I'm looking at you. Oh, look into my eyes. <laughs> Simple as that. You just get two receipts to say that you've sent it back. Um, they scan your QR code. The only problem they sometimes have with the QR codes is they are a bit too small. So they want you to zoom in on the QR code. So the easiest way to do that is just screenshot it and then zoom in straight away. And then delete screenshot. Easy. get 
much easier than that, could it? Order your stuff, go to the locker, sit there for three days, done! Collecting your parcels, it was easy as that. When, you, when you're buying something on eBay, just you can do the filter and uh, uh, do the click and collect filter. So then it'll only show you stuff um, that is available to be sent for click and collect. And pretty much everything is. So it's always a good way. New stickers, look at these. I've run out of them, so now they are all back. Loads of them, loads of them. You guys flipping are amazing. I love it, love it. Cheers for buying the stickers, guys. If any of you do want stickers, I might as well just say, because just in case any of you do, um, I usually sell two, two of each, and then I'll just pop them in an envelope and send them out to you. But if you see me in the street or out and about, you're more than welcome to get them for free. But if you do want any, link will be in the description below. Five pounds anywhere in the world. And there you go. <laughs> All right, just collected my stickers and everything. You know what day it is, don't you? Cheeky Chicken Tuesday. Gotta be done. Thank you. Bye. We have KFC. Win a winner chicken dinner. This ain't a bad way to end the day, is it? Done a few errands. And now a bit of YouTube, chicken, Love it. Right, I am on the M1. But I haven't really done much this week, to be fair. I've done a few little errands, you know, done my, done my laundry. But yeah, so I've been at work three days of the week at the beginning of the week, so it's now Wednesday, and now the fun begins. So as I just said, I'm on, I'm, I'm on the M1, and I'm gonna see Steve, uh, Steve, Lindsay, and uh, his, three, his three boys. Um, They've got a channel, Roman Radfords. Um, you probably know him as well as uh, he, he owns uh, Yowza Graphics. He's done my hoodie and my hat and all that. Um, he's top bloke, top bloke. They, they all are, they're a brilliant family. They're just excellent. Me and Steve had planned that I was gonna go to his for a couple of days. They've got this restaurant uh, or this takeaway, I don't know what it is, I still don't know what it is, in um, Milton Keynes called GDK, German Donner Kebab. I mean, Donner Kebab, I'm on it. German do, Germans do pretty good food. I'll eat a bratwurst any day. You know, uh, that, that came out a bit wrong, but you know what I mean? So GDK, yeah, they were like, you've never had one? I was like, nope. They're like, right, we've got to do that. And then and then we were talking about Five Guys, and I'm, I've never had a Five Guys burger. Um, and then Lindsay was like, what, you've never had a Five Guys? I was like, no, never had a Five Guys. So we arranged, I think it was for April, that we was gonna go over for two nights. We actually penciled it in, booked all the, di uh, put it in the diary, everything. And then obviously this whole, the whole COVID thing hit and everything just got shut down, completely put plans on hold. But now, today is the day we are doing it. So today I think we're gonna do, I don't know what we're doing today, what, what we're doing the German Donner Kebab or Five Guys, but we're doing that today, and then we're doing the next one the next day, and then Friday, whoo, this is gonna be great. We're gonna go to Kaz Bar, the burger bar. Uh, you've seen that in a previous video, and it's absolute banging burger man. So we're gonna go there on Friday morning, have breakfast, you know, have some proper good food, and then a farewell, farewell meal, and then they're gonna, um, they're gonna hit the road this is going to be a food bonanza. Yeah, I said bonanza. Can't wait. And I, it's just, oh, roll on the food. A bonanza. Hey, look, where are we going? <laughs> Out for dinner. Dinner. Five guys. Five guys. <laughs> I'm <five> stoked. <laughs> <laughs> Five Guys, food number one. Let's do it. Never done a Five Guys, so 
Pets, it was like, that is noisy fans. Just ordered a bacon cheeseburger with all the toppings. Um, well, the top line, so mayo, lettuce, pickles, grilled onions, grilled mushrooms, ketchup and mustard. Decent burger. It's a slippery slope now because I want more of them. <laughs> oh, the pickles. They all had tomatoes and then their, their burgers are slipping and sliding. See? Don't do it. Don't do it. You don't want that slippery sucker in your burger. But them pickles, wow. Absolutely amazing. And, and the chips. Oh, the cheese. Definitely got crack in it. That cheese has definitely got crack in it. Thank you very much. Cheers, guys. Woo I'm in the vlog. I'm in the vlog. Yes. Now, that was an amazing flipping burger. If none of you have ever been to Five Guys, I, and I've never been, that was my first time. Pop me cherry. That's what she said. <laughs> Yeah, that was an absolutely banging burger. The cheese, yeah, Ooh, definite <laughs> thumbs up. And cherry, vanilla, Dr. Pepper Zero. But you don't want the sugar, do you? I mean, you gotta watch the waistline, didn't you? <laughs> New sticker to add to the wall. Oh, oh, oh. Look at that. If you see me then, uh, and you've got stickers, make sure you give them to me because I will definitely put them on the wall. I want to fill that wall with stickers. Right, so I've been in the motor home all morning, editing this week's vlog, which will be up by the time this is out, definitely. Um, so I've been editing all that this morning. Steve's been running around uh, work, Lindsay's been doing a few bits. But now we're all together at Steve's. Look at the Teslas, look at the Teslas. One, two. All right, we're set up with the lads, ready yeah. to do a video, which is gonna be coming out in a couple of weeks. You ready? Yes. Yes, two cameras, ready to roll. Let's do it. Right, German Donner kebab time. Oh, the sauce, you like the white sauce as well. Cheesy ones, yes. Cheesy chips, they Cheesy look good. Cheesy chips. So this is my first German Donner kebab. It's looking banging. Mmm. Oh, that is good. The bread is awesome, isn't it? Ooh, yeah. Milton Keynes has got it going on. <laughs> Food yeah, is on point. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is good. 
the last bite. Oh, absolutely banging kebab. Never had one and I'm definitely gonna have them again. They are absolutely amazing. A few moments later. <laughs> Such a big kid with an ice cream. <laughs> Just to wash the kebab down, you know. There's a bug on my face. There's a bug on my face. <laughs> Gotta wash the uh, gotta wash the kebab down, didn't you? <laughs> That'd be rude not to. Not. It would not be a trip to Milton Keynes without a visit to Casbah now, would it? Let's go. The queue, every day, packed. The food is incredible. And I mean, just, just look at some of the footage I'm doing. And, and look, look at this. <laughs> look at this sign. <laughs> That's a breakfast box, yeah? Yeah. Look at that breakfast box. That's a killer rat. I know. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Look at that burger. Look at that. <laughs> Guys. See you later! Yeah. Ah, Casbah! We have food on board! Casbah burger! Yes! Cannot wait to munch this! <laughs> oh my god! This Casbah burger! Burger, bacon, hash brown, onions, egg, and cheese! Oh yes! You need one of these in your life. Definitely. The last bite. And then the food tour's over. Milton Keynes is done. I've hit it hard this three days. Hit it hard. Ready? <laughs> I'll see you guys in six weeks. It's been awesome. Yay. It's been a wicked couple of days. We've uh, munched our way through uh, the whole Milton Keynes. <laughs> the, uh, the kids are inside. They're already on, on, the, on their devices, ready to start traveling. Yeah, no sense out of them right yep, now. Yep, they're, they're all belted in and strapped up. All right, have a great time, guys. Cheers, Dad. Take it easy. See you guys later. Bye. Bye. Bye, have a good time. Yeah. I want to see some decent videos. Yeah, we will. Bye. 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 <laughs> what an amazing couple of days that has been. I had a flipping brilliant time with the uh, Roman Radfords. Absolutely cracking time. All that food was absolutely brilliant. I had a great time. The uh, German Donner kebab. That was. That was definitely something really uh never tried that and I'm definitely having another five guys. Gotta have another five guys. And Casbah. <laughs> I'm definitely But I think what we've learned from this is I'm definitely having all that food again at some point. Um It's gonna be great. But yeah, it's uh if you I mean the the Radfords are now on as you saw they've just left, they're now on their a six week trip to Spain and Portugal. 
So if you want to go uh, follow them and see their videos, they've just started their channel. It's relatively new. They've got quite a few. They've got a few videos up there at the moment. They're pretty cool. Um, but yeah, if you want to follow them, show them some love or anything, you can go have a look over their channel. I'll put the link in the description below, and I'll put it at the end of the video. So yeah, you can go over there and uh, say hi, and um, yeah, see what they're up to because they're. That's it's not an easy. I mean, they're not full time van life, um, but they're, you know they're doing some some pretty cool things and like to see new places and, and really explore. And they've got a beautiful motorhome, absolutely beautiful motorhome. That's it for this week, guys. So I'll catch you next week. Have a great weekend. Bye.